Καλησπέρα και από μένα. Good afternoon on my part. Thank you for this invitation. Here today it is a special pleasure and honor for me to be here with you. And it's a pleasure to take part in this event on the restart of uh, the Greek economy because research and uh, innovation are key pillars or are key pillars of this initiative and of uh, the growth of the Greek economy. Although the uh, indicators uh, for um, research and innovation in our country are rather low, uh, they've been improving according to the recent uh, um, announcement of uh, the research documentation uh, center. The expenditure of uh, for uh, research and innovation in Greece has increased immensely and uh, businesses uh, involved in research and innovation have also increased and what is really uh, impressive is that in one year from 1.27 percent of the GDP in research for research we uh, jumped to 1.5 percent uh, in 2020, the largest increase of the past uh, decade. So in only one year, we went from 1.25 to 1.5, considering that um, the forecast um, or the estimate was 1.30. Now, expenses of the businesses uh, amounted to 1.68%. And what is interesting is that the financing of businesses comes um, mostly by 83% from own from equity funds, from own capital. Now, the link between uh, innovation and uh, production, which presupposes a uh, strategic synergies between research centers, research institutes, and uh, the businesses uh, is a uh, perennial problem in Greece. In uh, the period 2014-2020, uh, uh, the secretary the General Secretariat um, implements a, has implemented a program in, in support of industrial research as well as uh, collaboration between uh, businesses and research institutes. Participation in this uh, uh, program uh, was unprecedented. Uh, several thousand of proposals uh, were submitted in the context of this action. There are approximately 1,300 research projects underway, financed by the state uh, with approximately 300 uh, million and having attracted um, uh, a lot of uh, private in investments and financing as well. The idea, the concept is um, to utilize the domestic research potential and to diffuse innovation through research centers towards businesses and among businesses themselves. You already know that uh, the new <coughs> NSRF for the next program period has been approved by the European Commission and the operational programs for the new period have already been submitted. Our country has taken the commitment to use the cohesion fund of um, uh, resources in specific um, for specific actions through the RFF, and we're going to improve um, the resilience of the beneficiaries. One of the, of the key targets, policy targets of the new NSRF is to develop a smarter Europe through an innovative transformation. For this purpose, our General Secretariat, in collaboration with uh, the services of the Ministry of Development and Investment, works on a new strategy of uh, smart specialization, which a part a smart expertise, which will um, take on in also include innovative uh, entrepreneurship, digital transformation, and uh, upskilling of the human resources, upskilling and reskilling of human resources. The idea is to the concept is to have a new paradigm that will be sustainable and that will rely on knowledge, uh, on rely on knowledge and research in order to be forward-looking. 
In this context, both um, RFF and NSRF funds will be mobilized, and including some programs um, in which our secretariat um, participates. In the new program period, emphasis will be placed on the support of research and innovation, taking uh, a lot of actions in order to boost innovation and disseminate it in the business um, world of our country. Actions include the development of dynamic uh, innovation in the startup ecosystems and the consolidation of long-term strategies between uh, the business, businesses and research um, organizations. The national development uh, strategy uh, and uh, in in, is intended to uh, increase the extroversion of the Greek economy. Uh, the competitiveness program includes an intervention that uh, will boost and um, support, rather, the extrovert, the most outward-looking, rather, um, industries of the Greek economy, and supported by the uh, Society of Knowledge. And this is also aligned with the EU Commission. EU policies, the green and digital transformation, promoting interventions and investments uh, that uh, serve the purposes and goals of the European Union. The strategic directions of the national uh, strategy on smart specialization for the current program period serve uh, the purposes of the overall policy. And there are four targets. First of all, enhance the uh, innovation research capabilities and leveraging of uh, capitalizing on uh, uh, new strategies, then uh, utilizing uh, innovation for the benefit of citizens. Uh, third, uh, SMEs. And fourth, smart um, specialization and uh, innovative entrepreneurship. The sectors where it has been decided or rather it has been proposed by us after a long consultation process that last more than 1.5 years um, regarding the research programs to be launched it includes the following um, sectors. Agri-food agri chain, medicine, uh, uh, biosciences, digital uh, technologies, s sustainable uh, energy, uh, transport and supply chain logistics, tourism and culture, and creative uh, industries. Another issue on which I would like to focus is the innovative actions of the Secretary General on innovation research and development, rather, research and innovation. In the past years, startups and spin offs have grown immensely. The establishment and uh, development of such businesses uh, is an indication of our turn to a new form of entrepreneurship, opportunities of higher added value, and contributes to the turn of the development model towards uh, the economy of knowledge knowledge-based, rather, economy. As I said, we need special actions that uh, support human uh, capital, the human capital and the startups, and um, enhance networking. In the context of our general secretariat, the National Registry of Startups was uh, implemented, as well as Elevate Greece platform. It, it, this is a, is a proof of a new concept, a new rather attitude aimed at uh, boosting the domestic innovation ecosystem in order to boost export, uh, out, uh, extroversion, the country's competitiveness, and to prevent the brain drain. In order to implement the National Register of uh, Startups, we had uh, to define what a startup is, to set the criteria for the designation, and adapt these to the Greek reality. There are two uh, criteria. First, innovation, and second, the uh, scaling up prospects. 
scalability of the project of the of the company. The ultimate purpose of Elevate Greece is uh, to boost the entire uh, ecosystem of uh, startups by after registering and mapping the entire ecosystem uh, to uh, enhance the networking amongst uh, businesses and support them with policies that incentivizing rather uh, policies and now this the aim of the platform is to attract expert staff uh, investor angels and venture capitals the platform also is used for kpis measurement of kpis in order to design appropriate uh, policies in the future at this point i'd like to say that this platform was first launched in December 2020 and to date there have been 573 563 businesses have been certified of which 372 are included in an NSRF program of 60 million euro regarding the uh, boosting of uh, registered startups that have suffered uh, the effects of uh, the coronavirus pandemic, and 200 of them have already received approximately 20 euro, 20 million euro. Now, this national registry of startups is a major step uh, in the direction of development, innovation, and growth. Uh, however, there are more actions uh, in the pipeline expressing the new concepts, such as uh, the first innovation uh, uh, area in uh, Greece through uh, PP, uh, PPP. This is a project uh, that has been tendered and there are four major companies, technical companies uh, that are, have uh, taken part uh, in the tender already. And we hope that we will have the contract or a uh, selected uh, summer. Then, then we have called Thessin Tech, um, major project, uh, innovation for the creation of an innovation center. We're going to also activate uh, on better terms regarding the assessment and implementation uh, of our proposals, a, a new program regarding act innovation. There are also the networks of research and university centers for pioneering actions in new research and innovation uh, facilities. We also have the so-called clusters, the competence uh, centers that have already been uh, financed. And finally, we have got the recent establishment, as Mr. Sirigo said earlier, of uh, the know-how transfer centers. The first invitation has already been announced by uh, this, uh, our secretariat, the Ministry of Education will um, announce uh, its own call for universities and then there will be synergies. And in this manner, we believe that the young and innovative Greek business people will find both in Elevate Greece and in all other initiatives already described a um, helpful aid uh, morally and financially in order to be able to contribute to our countries becoming a considerable force in the power in the global innovation map. Thank you very much.